Hello. So this is the demo that pretty much anybody could probably grab for Final Fantasy 15, uh, the Platinum demo. There was another demo that was available before, but I believe you had to buy the uh, the the uh, you had to buy the other Final Fantasy game. It wasn't a numbered one. It was something else. I'm not sure. Because I don't have a lot of... I don't have any experience with Final Fantasy games. <coughs> Pardon me. So, this is me checking out Final Fantasy XV. Because I haven't heard any details of Final Fantasy XV. But I've heard a lot of people being very hyped about it. And it's... It's a franchise that's made it to a 15. Plus, it's had uh, tons of other uh, other offshoots and spin-offs. Because I know 10, it had 10-2, and then it had 10-2. Like, uh, it didn't have 10-3, but I think there was a third one in the 10 series. Maybe just 10 and 10-2. But, and I know there's like Crystal Chronicles, and there's... Uh, oh, shoot. There's tons of... Tactics, Final Fantasy Tactics, and like, oh my gosh, like, so there's like 15 numerated ones, and like, it doesn't look anything now, like what I've seen pictures of the old Final Fantasy 4, which I think was the first one we had in America, or something, 4 or 5, so I don't know, but like, the Red Mage, and the, like, those pictures that I've seen of this game, like, they don't seem the same, and like, the uh, I know Final Fantasy VII remake is coming out, and it's going to be episodic. And I don't know, I don't even know what that's supposed to be. Like I've seen like a little bit of gameplay on it and stuff. People flying around in ships and everybody loving it. And there was the movie and I think so. Like this is like a really big franchise. And this one, what I've seen of fifteen, like it looks really crazy, but I have no idea what's going to be going on in this game like the little bit of st I've watched part of somebody else's stream on this uh, checking out the new Easy Allies stream going on but um, on that, that I saw somebody playing it and I was in this and so there's somebody changing from a kid to a oh there's a second language use the d-pad to do that okay with English. Audio language. English. Audio output. Stereo. Surround. That's fine. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'm listening to it on a headset, so I guess I'll just stick with stereo. But yeah. So I was watching that stream, and there's like you transforming from a kid to an adult, and then. Like I've seen the videos of this game where it's you're driving around in a car with like a bunch of bunch of other guys, I don't know. Giant monster thing. I have no idea what to expect from this game. But I know there's a lot of hype around it. So this is my first experience of actually playing a Final Fantasy game. This icon appears when you're saving. Please do not turn off while this is on the screen. Oh, okay. That's just there's a weird bunny unicorn cat thingy that was on the uh, that's in this title. Such a weird. I'd, I've never seen a demo that's like this. Is the platinum demo for this little tiny. The Final Fantasy 15 is like so small. I don't know what. Uh... Okay, still use the D-pad here apparently. Okay. You could order Final Fantasy 15 from right there. Okay. What is license? Oh. Okay. Alright, so everybody, screen cap that if they want to read it. Oh, there's another screen cap if you want to read it. <laughs> good, good grief. Options. God, this is so very. Uh, 
hard. Like, more crisp menu than what I would be expecting from this. Okay. Uh, is there vertical camera normal? No, wait, not the not the horizontal, the vertical camera. I play inverted, so. Crazy cat unicorn thing. This little horn looks so either bloody or like, like almost like like an animal penis. Like how it's very red and oh my gosh, that's <laughs> I've made a weird image for anybody listening to this later. All right, so new game. Now look at the weird head penis. Um, Maybe that's an iconic animal from the uh, Final Fantasy series. I don't know. Maybe that's what a platinum is. I don't. I doubt it. Join young Nick Noctis and his magical guide as you explore this fantastical world of a dreams. A okay. It's not going to let me hit A to start. And my hope from this is that it's trying to sell me on this game. Trying to show me how cool this game is and not be like a weird storytelling avenue. Because uh, I'm afraid it might be... Like, what is this place? like if it's just showing me this dream, then I may not care about the actual game. <laughs> and if it's something that's not in the regular game... Then, like, that would be really weird. Oh, you gotta go play the demo to know more about the game. It's like, why don't you just play the game to know about the game? And give me a piece that makes me think that this game's cool. Oh gosh, my broadcasting thing is gonna cover up all the... All the text. Okay. So, I'm not gonna know anything that this little creature says. All right, so there's move, sprint. If you hold, okay, so jump, roll, dodge, look around. Okay, and then this game looks as pretty as I expected it to, from other screenshots and stuff. Hey, what is this? Oh, I have one of them now. <laughs> oh, there's another one over here. But yeah, the foliage out here looks nice. Like there's a good amount of plants covering the ground. There's not, you know, it's not just full-on grass everywhere. Lots of big sticks and rocks and stuff around. Or just this little area that people probably just normally just run out of. Okay. It's making it kind of hard to walk around though. Okay, I have jumped up here. This is, this, I'm guessing this is just where those little three crystals were. I now have five yellow diamond crystals. Oh. Yeah, okay, I got the two fly. Okay, also saw the person I was watching stand on a lot of these, and I don't know why. Something sets in the dreamscape. Wow. 
What? Oh, I did a roll thing. Okay. Let's jump up here. This thing was big. In the trailer I saw was something big like that grabbing you up in a fist and then like smashing the fist in the ground and that seemed like it would hurt a lot. Ah! Oh god. I could have like missed all of those. I, I don't know if it matters if I get any of them but Oh, okay. Something has happened to me. If I'm going to wake up, I have to find the exit. Okay, this button has a sun and a moon on it. I think it's ticking. Okay. Okay, so the time has changed. I don't know if that matters. things up there. Stick with you and I'll be okay. Alright. Okay, can't jump up there. Mm -hmm, my hand. There's another big one over here. Okay, this one has uh, look weather it looks like because there's like a sun and a cloud and then an umbrella. If the weather changes. Does that just want me to show me the dynamicness of it, or does it actually matter? Because I like sunny. Sunny's good. Sunny's fine. Okay, that's the thing I jumped up onto a while ago. Having these things. Oh, okay. Okay, let's go to Squeaky Hammer. Start by pressing menu. Oh, no, that's not. That's okay. Not menu. View. Okay. So, here's that. Gotta use the D pad here. There's a toy sword and a squeaky hammer. The associate with the D pad? Okay. Okay, defend. Okay, B is my attack. Yeah, it makes little goofy noises here. I don't know what this is, how this relates to Final Fantasy. This is normal for Final Fantasy. Oh, these little things. They look like little, um. Little, little hats and curly toed shoes and stuff. I don't know what this is. Here's some sort of lake thing. Okay, I got the hammer. Okay. There's a button over here. Oh, I can't. 
Yeah, it's Squishy Frog. Okay. <laughs> it's, a, it's a squeaky on a frog. But there's shiny crystals over here. Some sort of, some sort of dragon, iconic dragon thing. Oh, I can see it go up, and then shiny, and oh, it's going into my lake over here. Okay. Because if you press it, you can get off of it. I don't know. Jumped in the water. No, we're drowning. Oh no, not a water drought. Drowned. Drowning to the simulator. Oh, hold down B to deliver continuous strikes. Hold an X to auto dodge enemy attacks. So, some enemy attacks cannot be dodged. So you hold. The Oh, I'm tiny now. So, I don't know if anybody saw my comment because there was like a lot of people commenting on it when I... Okay, I can't move. I'll be to grab a bomb and aim with the stick and then we'll launch one at your foes. Grab a bomb? There's a daytime button. There's a lock button. So there's holding the button. Tapping, okay. Tapping, holding, just holding the button doesn't do anything. So if you tap and hold, so tap it, so attack, tap and then, so basically to tap and then hold to do that. I don't know about the X and attacks and stuff though. Okay. Okay. Bring out your sword and then. No? Okay. So the sword can do it. I don't know if the hammer can. And it just goes pop, 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 pop. Hey, look, there's little crystal things. Do, 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 I guess I can just keep standing on it until it's the time I want it to be. Okay. I don't get that. I can jump back in the water puddle. The crystal things took me over here. What is this button? There's a car button. 
Um. Okay, there's new controls. Okay. Okay, I'm a car. And press A to turn to return to Noctis. Okay. Yeah, this game. This is not making me excited about this game. Oh, oh, hang on. Up here, Nocti. Oh, apparently I just kept driving into the table egg here. I mean, this is kind of neat. It's really slow. Is it, it's got maracas going? What? Okay. Oh, I, I kind of got it there for a second. Oh. Uh -huh. Oh, there's just some creatures over here or something. Driving into them doesn't do anything. Is locked. Like, I'm not driving this vehicle. I am this vehicle, so. This game seems very whimsical, much more whimsical than I thought. don't see what the point of driving around is. Is it just faster for trying to come over here and pick up stuff? Oh god, okay. I'm gonna press that button to turn back into this thing. Doesn't like it. Doesn't like it. Yeah. Oh, and I'll just keep going on to the next thing if I just keep holding it. I'll just attack the next weird nightmare creature thing. Wow, well, there's got to be a better button than just hold B to attack. Try this hammer out on actual enemies. Oh, let's jump on a book. All right, this is a animal instinct of the wild side, cutting edge Slayer secrets. Uh -huh. The book magazine. It's the exact same magazine. It's the exact same magazine. Time one. Hmm. Oh gosh, I fell off. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. 
Okay, the music is really, really whimsical. What is this? Is it another car button? Okay, is it the same car? No, okay, this car is cuter. Oh, we got a... Okay, enough of that for now. Because now I'm going to climb up this with the intent of sliding off. Like I did earlier. Like, okay. Alright, let's climb back around, see what's on the other side of these candy bars. What are these candy bars? What are they? They're like box of crackers, or like cookies. The little snack cake cookie things. This is the Platinum Demo of Final Fantasy XV. And... Oh, okay. Yeah, hammer is just like, pull out a hammer, smack him, pull out a hammer, smack him. You can still do the hold button thing. And it's, put, like, it's just like, pull the hammer out, smack, pull the hammer out, smack. <laughs> <laughs> Just attack the next target. It is a devastating attack, though. Knocks, them, knocks these guys down. I maybe should have got a car mode, but... Now, I normally love the, uh, like, the tiny person, like, tiny thing in a large, okay, a large made, space made by, like, a mundane area. So, like, this is just the inside of a room. Now, it's a very fancy looking room. It's got neat wall stuff on it and things, but, like, the Toy Story type environment where it's like, hey, you're a toy in, like, a real house. Okay, look, I found a hole. Secret book maze. And broke out into brightness again. Okay. Hammer time. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna still hammer him. I don't wanna get got by these other things. Oh, and I lost green spheres. I don't. Do I even have a health right now? Switch back to this just because it seems. Uh -huh. Yeah, this is, but so I think it's neat that this little. Setup exists here. Does that just fall down in that area that I explored down there? I don't think so. So, yeah, like I said, the uh, the realistic, oversized, regular place thing seems neat. I think it's cool. But but it seems really out of place, and I know this is a dream, like they've said. No things that it was a dreamscape or whatever. And there's dream connotations for things. Let's see what this car thing does. I'm a little white one. Okay. Okay, 
all of that. Go backwards, thank you. Is that symbol show up when you're in combat? Is that what that means? I totally intercepted that attack, dude. I got a cleave off on that guy. Okay, this fight right here is so very boring. As I literally walked up here, as soon as I saw that the first one that I could see had a target on him, I started just to hold the B button. And then I just went from guy to guy, just holding, like, I did not push anything else on the controller. Like, swear. And I just, just held the B button. And if that's the way most combats go in this, like, I know there's, there's some dodging and stuff that you need to do, but, like, if most of them can be handled by just, like, getting into, like, seeing the red line... But there's a combat going on, and then pressing the B button, and then just riding that B button. <clears throat> Man. I'm not, I don't think I'm the audience that they wanted for this demo. Because it's not making any sense. I have a feeling this dream is all there is going to be of this demo. And it doesn't make, it doesn't tell me what in the world's going on with the car. Like from the trailers or nothing. And so I'm just holding B. That's the only thing I'm doing right this second. Okay, these guys are much more health than those little goblin guys. But they still they still just stun lock into oblivion. Now these are level one nightmares or whatever. I don't know if there's levels in this game. Oh, I've been attacked. He got attack on me. I don't know if I have a health bar to be able to know anything. Okay, the environment is messing with just the whole B button down approach. Oh, that guy hit me. But I killed his friend already, so. I don't think I would have lost a lot of health from those attacks that I did get. And that was me only holding the B button. Oh boy. Oh man. This... Like, the game looks great. Like, and... And if I was going into this game thinking, Oh, this is a... Game. I don't remember this being over here. Was this over here a while ago? Did I just drive around it and not notice this at all? Because I feel like I would have noticed this. But, so, don't. I need to stop being sold that Final Fantasy is the big RPG game that's got a different fighting system than than the old ones, but like it still like has that great depth and well, I mean it may have weird depth. Right now I've seen just like large images and I spent a lot of time running around in this big biggest room. Okay, I, he's still saying stuff to me. But there. There's the car button again. But this time like he's just saying pictures. I don't know what those pictures mean. I don't know what a cactus is, like a laying down cactus creature.
There's a button. Can I tip over these cards? No. What was that? Receive a gift. I, I got a gift, I guess. I don't... Oh, oh, these blocks move. Oh god. Do all the blocks move? Oh, oh, oh shoot. I'm on a block, pushing a block. Oh god. So I, like because the cards didn't move, I was not expecting anything to move. Oh boy. Alright, so, ugh. I guess that was the point of getting to be in the car, then, is I get to mess around with the blocks, and I just missed the blocks the whole time, <laughs> so, let's, let's at least mess with that, just become a car, I'm a big ugly car. most effect. Maximum effect. Wow, it's stronger than the little tires on my car. Ugh. Push it. Push it. Oh my gosh. Push. Push. Ugh. Whatever this was, I no longer care about your creative your creative endeavors to put blocks on the floor. I don't care. That was the point of that, right? I got all of the points out of that. Okay, I'll turn back into a child. Sure. I was a car, now I'm a child. That makes sense. Okay. I also have yet to see a purpose for these collectibles. There's a purse here. I don't think I can get into the purse. There's another collectible here. Yeah. So, hearing Final Fantasy XV demo, I was not expecting life size, like toys, toys in a. Toy size existence game. Okay. These things are dominoing everywhere. Don't know how to get that one. Oh god, they are falling. Let's see if I can push this over here. So I'm gonna get on it and then get that. Oh no, that didn't work. Yeah, push that off. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, I got this one here. I can try again. Dragon. Okay. I have gathered that one collectible. Alright, so <clears throat> I may have mentioned a while ago that I, was, that, I, that I said in the other podcast that the part that I was seeing then, which is not this part at all, looked more like uh, Kingdom Hearts than Final Fantasy. 
was because I know the Kingdom Hearts is is more fanciful, not fantasyful, but fanciful, because it's you know Disney characters and mm, like Mickey Mouse with a Keyblade and like these other characters that they've made out of the Disney characters, the like King Mickey and and that stuff, but. I was judging that entirely on the fact that he used that he was using a squeaky hammer. And I was like, what is I can't, I can't see anything anymore. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay, so, yeah, checking this out, this is going to be a longer video than I would expect from a demo, okay, I'm going to pause the video for just a second to check the time. Okay, I did all that to get to this little collectibles over there, so I better get them. Push off the blocks. Push them, push them, push them. There are all the blocks on the floor. I don't know, but. It's kind of fun pushing these off. Oh god, don't fall off. I, I'm curious. I'm not going to test any of it, but I'm curious if there's somewhere in this room that you're not supposed to get to. That you can get to because of the like pushing blocks, like in a weird way, like all the way across the room. Okay, so there's creatures appear again. Again, I'm only holding down the B button. Oh, I just got attacked from the side there. Targets the next one, runs to him. Uh, chop on him for a bit. Uh, auto targets the next one, runs at him. He's running in a weird direction. Push, 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 push. Just stun locks it into oblivion. I got another one targeted over there. Get another attack on me. All right. Okay, I don't want to fall off. Okay, that thing perished when it fell. So. There's a weird ship over there. There's another collectible here. There's some more here. I don't feel like jumping into that thing just yet because this and this. I'm sure I could play with these if I wanted to. Ah. Did I bump those? And then just be falling down right now. <laughs> I did. I didn't realize I was bumped. Oh, 
Okay, also there's buttons on the floor that that said they were locked. Um, I didn't explore those if they unlocked when I got enough things or what. Mm. If I had a viewer, I could ask them if they were interested at all in, me, in seeing me drive around and push more buttons on the floor in this weird room. Oh, there's a time button. Time of day button. Now it's like morning or something. Daytime. Honestly, not enjoying this a whole lot yet. I like playing with environments. I can spend time doing that. <laughs> but if that's all this game is, then it's past. I don't think that's what this game is, but... But I think this game is something completely different than what I'm getting in this demo here. Because I don't see anything going on. Like, I don't feel like this is the first ten minutes of this game. I don't feel like this is a random level in this game. Alright, you're in front of a cart. I almost feel like, like this might be the hub world of a game. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but like, what is this? Oh god, what am I? I am a dragon thing now? I'm like an alligator with wings. Alligator with arm wings. Roar. I'm not tall enough to pick up those crystals though. I am much stronger though. Okay, I no longer like actually do combat things. I'm now just actually attacking one of the, whatever's in front of me. Alright. Okay, so I've transformed into a lot of things in this demo. I don't know if it's a theme or if it's just a feature or Transformations. This is not easy. Going from Hold down B to win. To like, you have to actually line up an attack. This is two very different forms of combat. Uh, almost like if I was having to choose the combat for a game, I would almost choose this combat over hold down B because like it's not boring. It's hard, but it's not boring. No, I'm not saying the combat boils down to that, but just like this bit that I'm seeing here. It, oh my gosh, was. Like, I was trying to literally show you. I don't have my camera on, so I could not show you. Like, I could, like, but, like, if my camera was on, I could, I could literally show you that I'm just holding, the, uh, that I was just holding down the B button. Okay, I did still pick that up. I can't go down that stairs. Is this creature. I have no idea how to... This must be the place. Can't go through the door. Can't go down the stairs. There's all these buttons here that I can't push. Or they're all blacked out or something, I don't know. I'm 
I'm guessing I might be able to still... Yeah, I can return to knock this with the A button, but... I haven't even pushed the Y button in this game yet. It doesn't do anything here. Okay, that's right, there's no jump, so there's just a return and knock this button. But I can step on this again. Oh, and I turn into a different creature. Oh, oh boy, I turn into a different creature. Is that the same button? Or is it? This thing is fast. Does it care about plants? Yeah, yeah, yeah. These are not circle plants, okay. But there's still another one of these creatures over here. Let's see if I can't antler him. Antler him! Okay, this, this one is even harder to use. Uh, turn it into something else. Okay, back into this thing. Okay, I can do this. Chop, chop. Roar. Roar. Jump. No, don't. Uh. Chop. Okay. Oh. These things are difficult to line up a shot with. I might should just turn back into Noxus so I can just hold B. But, like... <laughs> Just to get it over with, but I don't know. I want to have more fun with this. Look at this guy is wily. Rawr, rawr, gotcha. Ha. Huh. Neither animal was easy to use to attack with. Okay. I'm curious if I turn. I want to press this button one more time if I turn into the draft thing. Then I might walk around for that a little bit, but I'll know that. Okay. Oh, there's other things. Okay, what is this? This might have been easy to detect with. Oh, it's dumps. Okay. Yeah, these things bust up these boxes real easy. There's more collectibles down there. I can't get to. Oh, hey, it's people to fight. Oh gosh. Ah, oh shoot. <laughs> Wait, I hear something getting attacked. Okay, there's the time button. Oh, hey, there's some of these things. Oh, I detect with a weird jump. Okay, right now what I'm doing is spamming the X button. It does about the same thing as holding it. A gift! Raindrops times five? What? Oh, the big... Elephant-bison hybrid thing. Again. Uh. Okay, stop the rain. That's what we want. I don't just stop the rain. Oh, hey, look at these guys. 
thing is with me. Oh. Okay, these environments are big. They're sprawling. They're not very utilized, though. Like, does that... Like, there's lots of room to hide stuff, and there's the stuff that's hidden in here is just little floating gold crystals. And little fights with creatures. Okay. Also, this. What is that? Received a gift. Raindrops times five. Is raindrops in something I have in my inventory? Okay, it's a thing. I have fireworks and raindrops. Is that less of a toy? Is it actually... I don't know when I got that, but... Good gift. Mediterrane times five? I don't know. There's a button that makes... that has creatures on it. And it still makes the funny squeaky toy noise. That the other sword made. Mysterious bomb oh, okay. summons a, a shower went through him. I didn't bring back like all the bad guys in the whole area, did it? Oh, yeah, I'm getting experience from this too. So does doing things things even matter in this game? I received a gift. Uh, a shining hammer. This 
this is another, okay, I think I've... Oh, I did forget all about this thing. I meant to be like, oh, hey, remember that later. But we found it again, so it's fine. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm making this thing very devoid of commentary, and I apologize for not talking enough for that. Oh. We got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, I still haven't tested out the whatever bomb things these are. So, I guess I'll push this button and respawn everybody. Look around. Oh, wait, no, okay. Lock on. There's a. There's a. Right trick. Ah, okay. I've locked on now. Okay. That's a. That. Oh, that's the one with all the. <laughs> Good grief. That one's a lot more potent, apparently. It's <laughs> so ridiculous looking. Like, the squeak of the hammer was like, quite a bit, but dang. Oh, let's try this one here. This one's the rain one. Oh. Hey, there's a thing out over there. What does this do? Fireworks. Let's turn on the, uh, the shining hammer for a bit. Let's see how that works. Again, it's just like, bring hammer, makes flat. Okay. Now let's do this. And throw that. And there's a shower of sparks. I think it automatically runs to them. I uh, almost like one shot that thing. The shining hammer. Is it the hammer they used in The Shining? Um, yeah, sure, it's that hammer. Wait, what was that hammer? I didn't know the hammer they used in The Shining. What? Uh, I don't know, I haven't seen The Shining. You haven't seen The Shining? You got a hammer from it? Big crystal thing. Jump down there. Alright. You guys, you got a big... Oh, boy. There's all these big ones here. What am I going to do? Ow, shoot. Oh no, there's bouncy balls everywhere. Okay, that one is, is the funniest thing. <laughs> I've only got eight of those left. So I better use fireworks instead. Oh, this gives me more things. More fireworks. Okay. So I think this is where I'm supposed to go. Oh. What was that noise? Oh, he said something. Did I get more? Am I picking up these things? It's always been a real sleepy head. I was trying to check those little doors. As I was running through there, but I didn't see anything interesting. <clears throat> check the time here. I've got something I have to do in a little while, but 
Ooh, yeah, it's almost 7 a.m. here, so... Rah. And I know there's a whole other part to this. Because it's... Oh, it's going to be so weird to do a multi-part stream of a demo. Hmm. It's the Citadel. And if something doesn't feel right. Oh! This one will protect you through your darkest dreams. But remember, Noct. In the world of your dreams, you are king. Not afraid. All right. Okay, that hurt him quite a bit. Alright, so there's sprint, move, look around, lock on, jump. Okay. okay, that's the same. Oh, well, I'm getting drug. I'm getting drug. I don't like it. 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 There's a button here. I don't know what it is. Okay, I have a sword. And I have. Oh, God, what is that sword? Someone get some sword. Oh, I have a health bar now. I have a health bar now. And this thing takes most of that health bar. Okay, no, it didn't. Defend. Oh, that's the wrong button. Okay, see, now this is what I was more expecting in this game. Just, oh. Iron Giant. But then I turned back into this goofy kid. Okay, I'm trying to look at this melting thing here. It won't let me. I look at this post over here. Okay, so there's more weird buttons on the ground. And there's time change and day changes. Almost like if you wanted to set up some sort of like weird machinima thing, and that you could. There's like tons of. <laughs> All right, so we're in the place called the Citadel. The Citadel looks a lot more like what I've seen from other stuff. Now, what is okay? I now have a sword, and it has changed what I have equipped.
Hmm. And I saw this part. This is this is the part that I had seen on the other stream. And like turning in the kid afterward was the weird the weirdness that I was talking about. Hmm. So this is Oh, well, I guess. Hey, there's the car from the game. Or a car. It's the car from the intro thing. It's not the car that you cruise around with your buddies, I don't think. But... Okay. Wait. This little creature keeps talking to me. Name now. Oh, I have a name for my. Let's go with the carbuncle that it gives me there. Here's you. Okay, from all of us at the Final Fantasy VII team, carrying your favorite little magical guide. We look forward to seeing you again soon. I couldn't tell what that is. No. I. Okay, so. When I saw them, the other person uh, playing it, they could fight the th the creature again, and they would somehow were able to like throw their sword into the building and then like slam down on it. I don't know. And there was like some teleporting going on. Maybe if I was using that one button some more, I don't know. Oh. All right. So that's me playing it for an hour and ten minutes, apparently. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed that look at it. There's probably a lot there that I didn't do. This is a weird taste on this game. I don't think this is vindicative of what the tr what the game's going to be like. I think this was like a weird story taste. And so... This did not make me want this game more. But like the other stuff I've seen in the game makes me still want it. So... I don't know. Y'all be the judge of your own purchasing experience. Don't let me tell you what to buy, what not to buy. But uh, follow me on on Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash Sergeant Apple. Follow me on YouTube at youtube.com slash users slash Sergeant Apple. Uh, you can even follow me on uh, Xbox if you'd like. Uh, and follow Sergeant or SGT space Apple space OGA. On, you can see at the top of the screen there. You can follow me on that. Check, follow my progress on my achievements, and be notified when I'm broadcasting, uh, like straight on your Xbox. So, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I will see y'all in another video. Uh, bye bye. Now it's gonna take a little while to.